Hello everyone, welcome to Scott's Honest Reviews, The Life of Scott. So, today we have the opportunity to review a car phone mount. It's a two-in-one rotating dashboard or air vent cell phone holder. So, you guys may have seen in the past some videos that I have done reviews on. I'm very curious to see how this one stands up against those other ones. So, the bottom is inlaid with Eva foam slip mat, triple reinforcement, is more stable, soft material does not hurt the body. With a 360 degree swivel, you'll always have your device within the view and reach you desire. Product features, compatible with smartphones, GPS's and other electronic devices, high quality and adaptable durable mount frame quality grip arms holds device devices precisely so some warnings clip range should not be over 80 mm the elastic four of the clip will recede by exposure in the sunlight for a long time okay The little clamper so you press down and then you clamp in um, let's see what else we got in here looks like we have we got a base in here so you would pop that in there looks like we also have another type of base so this looks like you would clamp it on your dash or somewhere so right here this would slide over at some part of your dash depending on your vehicle make and it looks like it's got rubber protecting underneath it so this would go probably for your vent this would attach to your dash somewhere alright guys let's go test it out by the way guys let me show you this actually stretches out so depending on your phone or GPS or whatever electronic device you need so how our vehicle is we actually have a little spot here a lip so that is able to be put right there we could actually put that over as far as over here as well um, so it's all going to depend on your vehicle if you can use this or not. You can also get creative. I mean, if you really needed something, you could put it up on your visor like this. And then you'd have your phone or GPS or something up there. Um, so, you know, just basically be creative with this. And then, of course, you got this one. Which that simply clips on like so. So that clips right on to your vent or really anywhere else that you could clip it on at. Um, so there we have our phone connected into it. You can rotate it however you want, you know, 360 degrees. So if you want your phone up like that, you can have it up like that as well. So it's pretty cool. Um, you know, the only thing I think I would have to say is, no, we can't angle it any more than it is. Um, and how my vehicle vents are in here. Now, this is actually a little different. And um, I'll go into more details than my other vehicle. My other vehicle, the vents, I'm able to have it up higher. But for in this vehicle, this is about as high as I can get which is fine because you don't need it any higher you know I can still read GPS or whatever I'm doing on here so it works even though we can't tilt it up and angle it like straight out it still works the way it is we can move it left and right so that's still nice um, we also have other vents that we can put it on as well you know, we got these vents up here we could clip it on if we want to go sideways Here's another spot that we actually can act, have it up 
and that's actually straight out. So if you want to do a vlog or anything, you can have it over here. You know, this every vehicle is going to be different, obviously. So each vehicle, you know, you're going to be able to mount it at different spots. So for this vehicle, we can mount it here, we can mount it here, we can mount it over there. And that's just this setup, you know, obviously we can t turn it. Still be able to have it sideways and still have it up higher. So we're actually able to basically put it up however we want. We want to get it straight, go ahead and get it straight. So that works out good and that's actually pretty good if you want to look at your GPS and you don't want it like up there or whatnot or just somewhere to have your phone so overall um, turn it however you want overall I think you know once you get it set up once you get everything where you want it to. Um, let's check out the camera here. So, so that's how it is if I would vlog. Um, so we'd see the steering wheel blocked a little bit by the steering wheel if I wanted to do a vlog. On this position we can go ahead and move this over here. So that's definitely much better for vlogging. So if we wanted to vlog, you know, it's fine. Um, we still see the steering wheel here a little bit, but we could have moved it over here. And what we did, we put it at the bottom, and we're able to angle it up even more now. Since it's at the bottom, we actually can go even higher. So it's actually perfect. Um, like I said, it's basically getting it set up to where you want it is going to be the biggest key on this product. Um, so once you get it mounted how you want it, you know, it's going to be, it's not going to fall anywhere. It's stuck and it's staying there. So like I said, once you mount it, um, it's good to go. So as far as ease of figuring that it out, maybe a 7 out of 10. Um, durability, probably a 7 out of 10. Uh, quality, probably 7 out of 10. Um, Overall, we just took a picture. <laughs> Overall, we're probably, I'm probably going to give it a 7.5, maybe 8 out of 10, probably 7, so between a 7 and 7.5 out of 10. Um, that would be my honest opinion on it. Like I said, once you get it situated, I think it's a whole lot better of a product. At first you might think, well, where am I going with this? And you might try different spots and think, well, it's not really working, so that's kind of pointless. But no, you just need to mess with it. And once you get it set up, then is when you're going to get the 7 to 7.5 out of 10. Um, so, do I recommend it? Yeah, I think it's a good product. I think it has its applications and good use. Each vehicle is going to be different, but... It definitely works for me. It'll work in all of our vehicles that we have. So, that is my opinion.